Oh wow, you actually got it. Nice. Let's say it's lo It's I hate this level, Golden. So I know you're paying. Oh shit! It's, this, le this level is fucking terrible. All right. So it's, so, it's... so do you want to take a peek at my screen so I can show you what it looks like? No, uh, I do when I do the skip. I want to see this. I've never done the trick before. Okay. I can't fucking believe this. Don't even fucking look at me. I'm looking absolutely ashamed. Alright, whatever. Alright, here we go. We'll just fucking, from the top, show it from the beginning. Eggman, pull the trigger. Just fucking pull yeah, the just, trigger. Just, just get rid of her. Just, yeah. just kill her all. She's a pathetic... She just... Yeah, because there's people like, Oh, you have to understand, Amy's just a... Nah, no, Sally. Okay, I end my fucking case. Sally's better. Yeah. 100%. Objectively better. Amy is a pathetic excuse of a love interest. Oh, okay. I understand this now. It Easy. seems a little tricky. The spin dash thing can be tricky. It's, yeah, the spin dash part can be tricky if you don't, like, immediately get it. But, let's see, here's the thing. A rank. Hmm. The more I learn. Because I didn't know that was an actual trick. I it's, I else. mean, like, it's mainly, mainly it was because I didn't want to go through the entire fucking crazy gadget puzzle. I was just like, how, like, it, because I can get clearly very close to the end right from the start. Yeah. So long as you use some, so long as you use some, like, clever jumps. And then ever since then, I was just like, yeah, why would I ever do it the normal way when I can complete it in, like, a third of the time? By just doing it that way. I will say though, Golden, none of the dark levels besides like maybe one or two are really that annoying compared to this one. I mean, how how long is the um Honestly the Dark Story is not as long as the hero story. Because like the thing about this game was it was originally kinda meant to be like a Sonic only title. And then they had the idea, like, halfway through, oh, what if we also had, like, the dark characters have a story, like, all the evil characters had a story. So they kind of just expanded upon some of the levels that Sonic was going to have. Like, Skyrail is a notable one, like, because, like, there was promotional material of Sonic, like, clearly in the Skyrail level. However, in the game, Skyrail is Shadow's level, so, like... It was pretty much towards the very end. They were just like, "Oh, hey, let's like, let's make this uh, something that's accessible towards the dark characters as well." Ow! So it's it's not it's not quite as long. Nope. I don't want to say like half as long, but it, like three two fourths. thirds as oh, long. Oh Jesus! Yeah. I got fucking blasted by a fucking beam. Yeah. What I do in that fight, Golden, is I don't worry about targeting. I just kind of just pew pew him. Okay, then. Honestly, yeah, that's kind of your best bet. Just I pew pew him intro, constantly. Because if you target, you're going to accidentally hit the middle thing. That's also, like yeah, if you hit him with the Vulcan cannon, it also just counts as like a lock on hit. So. No. Just run around, run around. You're good. You're I'm good. going, I'm going, I'm going. So you're doing fine. Jesus Christ, dude. How many of... Wait, did he just hit himself? No, the explosion thing hit him in the back. Yeah. What, but where, it was where, funny. Did, where did the explosion come from? The middle thing. Yeah, the, the pillar in the middle blows up if you shoot it. So, so he basically that can killed also himself. <laughs> yeah. Is there, it's one more station than the final boss, right? It's... Final Rush, I think, is the last stage. That's not a bad stage. Final Rush is pretty fun. I enjoy Final Rush. <clears throat> Apparently the Japanese version of this game is a lot darker. I'm not surprised. Oh, yeah. Wouldn't be shocked if that was the case. 
and things a lot like no, obviously the words flow a lot better and shit like that. The fucking uh Ah, okay, so I have to select which ones? Oh god. Well no, really? No. So Really? You you you're sometime. not gonna grab onto it? Okay. You don't have to do that, Golden, on some of them, but not that one. You just go straight, keep going straight, and then at yeah, the you end, can, just jump off. You can just go straight, yeah. So the idea is, one, you want to be crouching on these rails, because crouching increases your speed. And two, uh, rails that end in green, if you hit A at the very end of them, you'll you'll do like a jump. I actually didn't know that. Yeah, you'll do like a jump and it'll like send you really far. Hmm. The red ones don't end like that. Like the red ones won't give you a special jump. You can jump at the end of them, but they won't like give you a like a special jump. The green ones will though. Okay, I didn't expect it. To oh. You know there is a cheese to this level. Well, I think the first spell there is, not the normal one. There's a there's a there's a few cheeses to it. So solar in the pyramid race. Did you ever cheese the fuck out of it with other people? There should be some silly button to just automatically grab onto the rail instead of having to manually grab it, because this is getting ridiculous. I, I kind of like Sonic Adventure 2's rail grinding system. I, I, I think, like, having the button to just, like, automatically jump between rails kind of eliminates some of the challenge of grinding on them. Like, in Sonic Unleashed, it kind of made sense because the idea was you were meant to go fast without, like, without having too many drawbacks to that speed, and it was, like, one of the first games to actually, like, really accentuate that. But every Sonic game since then has kind of just copied that no! formula. No! You did it again! Where it's just like, oh, just press a button, and then you automatically just, uh, the rails grind themselves, and it's just like, well, I mean... Sonic Adventure 2 kind of had it down. Yeah. Go! I'm going to say this is all trial and error. So you're doing fine. Sure, just go ahead and go right through that. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Oh, I was supposed to go down. I can't You're fine. I can't tell You're whether fine. or not there's a like okay, what's that noise in the background? What do you mean? I'm hearing noise in the background. Riley, is that you? I think it's Riley's video. I'm hearing like commotion. Oh uh, yeah. I hear it too then, yeah. I don't know uh, what it is. I'm not hearing anything on my end. Yeah, because like you're the one way. listening to it. No, I mean, I'm not hearing anything like that sound that you were mentioning. No, no, no. Ooh, Holy shit. Close. Yeah. Grind there. You're good. Unlucky. Very unlucky. Sonic okay, Convention 2 this? is literally so fucking ingrained in my bloodstream that I can, like, I, I'm just surprised that every time I pick it up again, I still remember some of the tech to it. That's how I am with, like, uh, this Capcom game called Contra Force. I'm, like, the same way. That is one of the things about this game that I really like. Like, even though there are a lot of problems to it, it also has a surprising amount of speedrun tech, if you really look into it. Mm -hmm. I mean, isn't that what this game was supposed to be designed for? Uh, I don't... I don't know, actually. I, I'm not sure if it was actually designed for speedruns. I mean, it's Sonic. I, it's speed. I mean, speedrunning, like, didn't... 
Speedrun didn't really exist then, did it? No, oh, I mean... fuck. I went a little too far. Yeah, I, I know what you mean. Yeah, I, I get what you're saying. But, like, I don't think the actual concept of, like, speed running was really a thing until... I want to say, like, about the 2010s is when it, like, be like really took off. I want to say, whenever Twitch became a thing, that's when it started becoming a thing. That's, that's what I remember. But I didn't have internet until, like, 2011. So, who knows? I got, <laughs> I got internet in 2006. Then I was delving into anime. I was episodes of Naruto. No, sub. grapple. <laughs> Same fucking Plinda death. Three parts on YouTube. Boy, yeah. they really dragged this death out. I think. Oh. That was a close call, Jesus. Yeah. Indubitably. Indubitably. I have a feeling that if I play this game more often, I just get better at it. Eh, uh, that's probably that's, one. That's, that's, that's how I got better at it, is I just fucking slammed my head against the wall until I figured it out. <laughs> yeah, that's usually how it goes. Uh, 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 uh. Was I not supposed to go that way? No, you're supposed to. You wanted to, like, you want to go fast at it. So go. Oh, Woo! Hmm. Not that far, but you got the idea. Sometimes it really do be like that. Apparently. There you go. You can also do your bounce bracelet right there. You fuck off. God, I hate those things. Uh, one of these gives you a life, actually. I, I don't think anybody one. actually enjoys the artificial chaos clones. Go to the red one, so golden. I think that one gives you a life. Kind of a son of a bitch. Oh. Interesting. That helps. What the fuck? No! No, 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 no! Remember, you use your bounce bracelet if you need to. Bounce bracelet gives you a lot of extra height. There you go, an extra life. Mm. Nah, ah, ah, ah. Oh, you fought against the camera, good job. Yeah, the cameraman... Sometimes I it really do be like that. Yeah, no, I swear, the cameraman in this game and Lakitu from Mario 64 just team together to conspire the main protagonist. I believe it. <laughs> ah, 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 ah. Stop having a fucking seizure, dude. Ah, 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 ah. No. No. So, yeah, like, one of the, one of the, uh, the strats I use for that is just homing attack against the rail. And that'll usually, yeah, get you enough speed to go up. I, I just try to think of it as a safe thing for ah, him, so I thought ah, bounce, ah. bouncing would be the better way, but I don't know. That way he has no extra momentum to work against him. Uh, uh, uh. That alarm sounds getting really annoying. But it's meant to be dangerous. <laughs> Unfortunate. You got... Oh, you get a lot of lives, so you're yeah. fine. Oh, I 
Fucking god. You were supposed to grab on the fucking rail, and you decided to just commit. N you just decided to commit toaster bath. Okay. Commit seppuku. That was seppuku. funny. Seppuku. Toaster bath. A cable um, is stuck under the wheels on my chair. Get off! I hate that shit. Yeah, I, I do. hate it so much. I'm a wireless boy for that reason. What was that? You hit the uh, corner. So you you bounce attacked and you hit an angle, and because you were going at such a rapid downward momentum, it translated some of that into horizontal momentum. By the way, that's actually some that's actually some movement tech that you can use to your advantage. So if you're going at a wall at a very high speed, and you use the bounce attack and you bounce right as you hit the wall, your uh, your downward momentum gets. Who's fucking using a ratchet strap? I'm hearing that too. I heard that. It was Riley. Yeah, your downward momentum gets translated into horizontal momentum, so it's uh, so it's, so it can be used to gain some extra height, which is nice. Oh. Uh... Yeah. So I'll I'll tell you. Yeah, the best way to get over these rails is to just homing attack straight towards them. Because the homing attack will give you more than enough speed to actually make it. If you try to bounce attack, you'll more than likely not actually get enough, like, actual speed to get over them. I so just... Uh, you go ahead. Yeah, I just I, I just say homing attack straight into them. Because, like, otherwise that'll happen, yeah. Oh my oh. god! That's gonna shut me. Just go. Just go. Just fucking go. I just remember doing the bounce stuff when I was a kid. Because I saw the grinding, too. And so I would just bounce against the thing and just hop over it. Sorry, I was checking out VR chat while talking, guys. Gross. Sounds yeah. like you're using a rock a wrench. Ah, 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 ah. No, I got the the strap thing, the elite strap, so I can adjust that thing a lot easier. It's not like, yeah, so much better than the strap it comes with. Sonic, you were supposed to grab the other ring. Ah, uh, other way. Other way. You're fine. Just hold the crouch. There you go. Yeah. Run away! Run away! Run away! Yeah, so those green... Those green, uh... Those green grind rails, if you hit A at the end of them, you'll do, like, a special contextual jump. Sonic, I told you to jump over that pit. Now look what you did. You just cost <laughs> me the entire effort. Now Sonic. you died. That's no good. Remember what Sonic says. That's no good. Move! Holy shit! Laws of physics are so defied so badly! What was that?! Holy shit! Is this Sonic Adventure 2 or Sonic 06? The... So You'll be surprised. It, it's Sonic 02 or 01. I think it actually did come out in 01. Either it did. Battle came out in 01 or 
SA2 itself came out in 01. Well, I know Battle came out in 01. I don't know about Sonic 02. No, Sonic or Sonic it, SA2 came out earlier than that, so I want to say it was probably like 99. Let's let's take a look. Nope. You were supposed to ride the other rail. You were supposed to ride the other <sighs> rail. You are so fucking ADD. Sometimes you really just gotta let it fly. You were supposed to just lean over, Jesus. That makes no sense. What Solar. makes no sense? So, uh, I looked up, uh, when Adventure 2 Battle came out. It came out on June 23rd. I'm sorry. Uh, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle came out December 20th, 2001. Sonic Adventure 2 came out July tw June 23rd. They might be flipped. They had to be. There's no way it's not the other way really? around. Yeah, because Battle really? was the port. Yeah. He went right through the fucking rail. Just hop to the other rail. Don't jump so fucking high. Holy shit. It's not rocket science. <laughs> Well, shoot. I mean, when you're going at that speed, maybe it is. I mean, there's a lot of rockets involved in this stage. You know what I'm talking about. It shouldn't be that hard. Yeah, I get you. Just like, just automatically hit the other rail so that way I won't fall to my doom so fucking much. I mean, you can automatically home in on enemies. Sure, no problem. You can automatically home it on springs. Sure, no problem. But rails, oh no. They're like a disease to you. You have to avoid them or some shit. You fuck off. What's <laughs> what's down here? Something else. Why did you stop? Can't believe this. There it is. Oh, uh, no. yeah, there's nothing behind you. There you go. 